in Joshua, he is that scarlet robe that was given to, to, to Rahab the harlot. That scarlet robe. Scarlet is red, which is symbolic of the blood. And because Rahab believed and took the robe and held one side, and the children of, of, of those spies held the other side, there was a connection between Rahab and God's people. So by that typology, Rahab believed in the gospel of the blood. That's how Rahab became a righteous person. So that scarlet was symbolic of Christ in the book of, of, of Joshua. That is what is symbolic. The scarlet robe. And we can go on and on and bring out other revelations. I'm just giving you teasers to help you see. In Judges, he is a secret. Because in the book of Judges, chapter 13, verse 18, he talks about secret. He is a secret. Same word as wonderful. The name in Isaiah. Which means the word secret, which is wonderful, is figurative. Is a figurative representation of Jesus. Remember, the Old Testament is Jesus concealed. The New Testament is Jesus revealed. The Old Testament is mystery. The New Testament is revelation. The Old Testament is the New Testament concealed. The New Testament is the Old Testament revealed. So, to understand the Old Testament, you will have to wear the binoculars of the New Testament and look at the Old Testament. It's one book. The Bible is not books. It's one book. And the message of the Bible is not you will make it. It's not you will succeed. It's not you stole your wedding gown. It's not 15 keys or 35 pillars. The message of the Bible is a person. His name is Jesus. And anything preached out of the Bible that is not Jesus is a waste of your time. The message of the scriptures is Jesus. He's the diet that believers feed on. Are you still here?